gut dass ich das habe. When I was very young, our elder used to sing this song. And what are the songs about? Their song told story of a great man who built a big dao with their hands. They spoke of the wind and tides bringing foreign merchants from all over the world to our little island. Colorful people from different lands speaking colorful language. It must have been so different back then. As children, we would watch our fathers come home with fish and food. Then our ocean were rich with life. It was a gift from God. We were very simple people, more connected to nature and one another. I grew up in a time when the Dao connects people. It was only way to communicate across the world. But then, there were train, cars, and planes. And more people began to come to our islands to see how we live, to feel the peace of our home. Tourism became a way of our life. And soon, we become reliant on what tourists like you brought. But time changed fast as the world grew smaller. Now there were not only merchants and tourists coming to our shore, but waste too. Plastic in particular, the enemy of our water. Our beaches filled up with waste. The tide wash in more every day, receiving a lot of trashes from everywhere. We became ignorant of the monster that we were creating together. And then, one day, the clock stopped. The world closed down overnight. In our life, we learn that storms come and go. So in the face of a new enemy of our world and water, we found a way and adapt and survive to this situation. So what did you do? One day, I dream of a Dao. A Dao that will sail through all the ocean of plastic. And as the Dao was sailing, the Dao itself became a plastic. I knew what could be done. Nothing is impossible. Kila kitu inawezekana. Our people came back together. Our artists create ideas to give a plastic second life. It creates jobs for our people. And then the world eyes turn to us again. And they saw how our community use innovation and passion as tool of rebuilding our lives back again. Children organize events. Our fishermen help gathering together in 
in the ocean and collect plastic. The stories of our innovation spread across the world. Fully recycled plastic and flip-flop board to convert plastic waste into building products. India is among the countries to have vowed to ban single-use plastics by 2022. Other communities around the world found new ways to reuse plastic and clean their environment. Tourists came back and our laughter returned back.